I found myself speaking at an event a couple of weeks ago and they asked for the single best piece of advice I had and I always think that's a really awkward question because to be, the fact of the matter is it's just something instantly pops into your head. It might not necessarily be the best piece of advice you have but it's what comes to you. And what came to me at that time was that for everybody I think they should take an hour uh, a week or an hour a day if they have that luxury but certainly an hour every week to reflect um, to reflect on how the week's been, uh, what they liked about it, what they possibly didn't, uh, to reflect about themselves in terms of how they dealt with certain scenarios, um, what they liked about that, what they didn't, and off the back of that kind of think very consciously in terms of how they want to progress. When they meet the same kind of obstacle, how will they, how will they deal with that? How do they want to refine themselves, their personality, their character to suit actually how they want themselves? Anyway, that's my waffly way of uh, explaining why I've taken so much time out um, in posting these vlogs. Um, for me, I jumped into the idea of video content on YouTube. Um, I, I think it's, I think it's a, such a special medium, and I think it's really, really, um, yeah, I think it's a really, really interesting thing. Um, however, I was committing a whole load of time to it, and I didn't necessarily know where I was going with it. And I think when you're aimlessly doing something, um, that's not good and you need to actually think um, so for me I knew I got a kick off kind of sharing the lessons I was learning um, or the challenges I was going through um, so hopefully others kind of following a similar a path could learn at my expense and speed up their entrepreneurial journey and that was good um, but the fact of the matter is it kind of is well, there's a cost involved for me in terms of time and in terms of resources and I wanted to make sure um, that I could justify that then going forward um, so really, I suppose the kind of simplest way of putting it is that I actually had to kind of build a business model around what it is that I wanted to do. So I knew that I love the idea of sharing. I, I have seen the benefit. I've got really nice positive feedback and that's been really encouraging. And so I, want, I kind of came to the kind of feeling or position that I was like, okay, this is how I want to progress and move forward. But if I'm going to do that, I need to make sure I structure it in a, in a way that it actually sustains itself and that it can grow. Um, and I think I've done that. So rather than you know laying it all out in front of you and committing to something um, that perhaps might tweak and refine over the coming months, what's nice is to be in a position where I can say, I'm back. And I don't mean that in any kind of ridiculous fashion, but it's actually really, really nice to get back to the position where I can actually start sharing some content and I know where ultimately speaking it's going. So um, if you used to watch these videos and now you're watching again, um, I am thrilled to be back in touch um, and if you haven't and you're seeing this for the first time um, keep watching because I really really think you're going to like what I'm up to and where we're going.